The company will sell the 2024 Tesla Model Y, which is a small crossover SUV. Since it was one of the first fully electric compact crossovers to come out on the market, it's become the standard by which all other cars that have tried to fight in this market niche are judged, and for good reason. It has a lot of space and comfort, a long range, and a lot of power, and a lot of the tech features that most Tesla users love. Even though the Model Y is the standard for its field right now, competitors from well-known companies are moving quickly to catch up. Because of this, it's possible that Tesla is getting ready to improve the Model Y for the 2024 model year. At the moment, it's all just a suggestion, but we think that newer changed features and better style both inside and out are the most likely additions. Be aware though that Tesla does not always make updates at the same time each year. Even though it's not a sure thing, any change could happen in 2023 if it does. The changes will likely help the Tesla Model Y keep its strong lead in sales, but smart EV buyers should still look closely at the Ford Mustang Mach-E, the Hyundai Ioniq 5, and newcomers like the Chevrolet Blazer EV. Automotive News said in an article that came out on March 1, 2023, that Tesla plans to start making the updated Model Y in 2024. The Model Y is a crossover vehicle that's similar to the Model 3 car. The electric SUV, whose secret name is Tesla Juniper, might be called the Tesla Model Y when it goes on sale in the United States in 2024. It's possible that the 2024 Tesla Model Y will look different in the same way that the 2024 Tesla Model 3 looks different. Spy photos show that the front hood and wheels of the first car will be different. It's possible that the SUV will get the same updates to the way it looks on the outside as the car. Like cars today, it had a bigger body and side flares that made it stand out from a sedan. As a visual sign that it is an SUV, it has a cutout on the sides of the front bumper in the shape of an L. Inside the new Model Y, there may be a new panel and touchscreen entertainment system that can be turned. Neither of these features were in the model it's replacing. During the refresh, Tesla may improve the quality of the materials, offer an optional steering yoke, and add an instrument panel to the Model Y. All of these things could be changed. It's been said that Tesla plans to get rid of wood trim in the Model 3 with an update in 2023, and it's possible that the company may also get rid of it in the Model Y. The Model Y's cabin is available in all black, black and white, or all dark color schemes. The fully dark version has wood trim for a sportier look. Even though the wood trim in the all black house might match the two-tone color scheme, it looks like it doesn't belong there. As a possible replacement, the company could use Alcantara or another high-end synthetic material. There's also a chance that the Model 3 will have an ABS-bonded foam non-woven cloth. A Tesla employee named Chris Singh said on Twitter that the Model 3 will have this material. Specifications We don't know yet if the new SUV, the 2024 Model Y, will have different technical features than the model it replaced. This one comes in three different all-wheel drive versions with two motors, standard, long range, and performance. People have only recently been able to get their hands on the standard form. Based on the information we have, this type is the one that has the newly developed 4680 cells and the newly developed structural battery pack. The EPA estimates that its range is only 279 miles, which is much less than the competition. It's also slower, but not by a huge amount. It takes 5.0 seconds to go from 0 to 60 miles per hour. On the plus side, it uses about 28 kilowatt hours per 100 miles of energy, which is about the same as the long range variant and it costs $3,000 less than the long range version. The basic model can go as fast as 135 miles per hour. The EPA says that the long range type can go up to 330 miles on a single charge and can go from 0 to 60 miles per hour in 4.8 seconds and as fast as 135 miles per hour. For the same things as the normal model, the performance model has ratings of 303 miles, 3.5 seconds after taking off one foot for rollout, and 155 miles per hour. For reasons that should be obvious, the EPA says that it uses more energy than the other car, which uses 30 kilowatt hours per 100 miles. Price and release date. In April 2023, the price of the Tesla Model Y went down by USD 3000 for everyone. Due to the price change, the standard range model now costs USD 46,990, the long range model costs USD 49,990, and the performance model costs USD 53,990. We don't think that the facelift will lead to another big price drop, at least not by a big amount. 
Automotive News says that Tesla wants to start making the updated Model Y in the year 2024. Shipments to buyers should start in the same year. The Tesla Model Y will sell a lot of cars in 2023. The Tesla Model Y sold a shocking 267,200 units around the world in the first quarter, according to data put together by Jado Dynamics and released by Motor One. During the same period, 256,400 units of the Corolla model were sold and 214,700 units of the RAV4 model were sold. See how these numbers compare to the total. This is a big deal because it shows that the Model Y has grown by a staggering 69% from one year to the next. This shows that customers are becoming more interested in the product. The fact that Tesla is the leader in the electric car market. The slow pace at which Tesla's rivals are making electric cars is one of the most important factors that's helped the Model Y become so popular. As Tesla keeps making new products and adding to its line, it's hard for other companies to catch up. This has helped Tesla keep its top spot in the market for electric vehicles. Also, Tesla's made their cars easier to buy by dropping their prices in a planned way over the years. This includes cutting the price of the Model Y, which has helped sales go up. Tesla's market standing. It's important to remember that having the most popular car in the world is not the same as having the most market share in the automotive business as a whole. Even though the Tesla Model Y has been called the best-selling car in the world, the company's income and unit sales are not on par with those of Volkswagen, Toyota, General Motors, and Ford, which are all big names in the car business. The fact that Tesla is now the 19th largest automaker in the world shows that well-established market giants can stay around for a long time. Predictions that Musk made Elon Musk, the visionary CEO of Tesla, has said for a long time that he thinks the Model Y will be a big hit. Musk has said many times that he believes this. Even though this statement's already been made, he told investors in 2021 that he thought the Model Y would be the best-selling car in the world by 2022. Even though the goal wasn't reached, the Tesla Model Y did well enough to come in third place in the world rankings for 2022. Even though pickup trucks and full-size SUVs are very popular, it still made it into the top 10 list of the best-selling cars in the United States. The Model Y was so popular that it was the best-selling car in every single area where it was sold, including China, California, and Europe. The fact that the Tesla Model Y is now the best-selling car in the world is a big step forward for the automotive industry's shift to electric vehicles. Tesla's ability to beat its competitors and catch people's attention at the same time shows how committed the company is to new ideas and transportation that's better for the environment. Even though Tesla's had problems and had to return some of its products, the company's continued success shows that it's had an effect on how electric cars will be made in the future. The growing desire for environmentally friendly and energy efficient ways to get around doesn't change the fact that Tesla is the world leader in electric vehicles. Thanks for watching this video.